So it's that time of year again of Valentine's Day and I'm super excited and today I'll be showing you how to make a lot of cool DIYs for lots of people and it's like some gift ideas. Um, it can be for anyone, a brother, sister, mom, dad, or if you're older, boyfriend. So I have lots of things here for Valentine's Day and I got every single one of these things from the dollar store so it's really cheapy. And I just love Valentine's Day. So right here we have lots of candy and some plushies. They're so cute. Got a frog, a monkey, and a bear. Got some little sharpeners. Some little heart shapes. Chocolate. Candy. We got some gummy hearts, some pom-poms. Little baggies, heart sticks. Tape. We got these little stickers and a little box lollipops, little slinkies, lip pops, some more chocolate over there, pencils, erasers, two boxes, and some little cans. Got some chocolate back here. Back here I have some beautiful pink roses with these cute little hearts. Really cute. I got this giant marshmallow pop just shaped as a heart. We got a little marshmallow rose here and a little puppy chocolate. Then we have a pink plushie, just so cute. And it is inside this beautiful little cup. That's hearts. Okay, so on to my first day I want. You're going to take any cup that's for like Valentine's Day. Mine is just a plastic cup with some cute hearts. So you're going to take that. And I got these bags from the dollar store. These are like some tree bags that you can put lots of candy in. So you're going to open it. I feel like this is Monday blind bag thing because I'm cutting something. <laughs> so I'm going to get a bag. I'm going to open it. I'm going to grab some candy and some chocolates and just stuff it in there. Kind of like you're stuffing a turkey. So I'm going to open this. So this is how it looks. Look how cute this is. This is cookies and cream. That sounds yummy. Mmm. Let's engulf ourselves while we make this DIY. Yum yum. So I'm going to try it. Wow. So this is how it looks. The cookies and cream. Mmm. Let's go. So now let's put a few in the bag. I'm going to grab like two of each. Put two in there. So I'm just going to put them and I'm going to do the same with the rest. These are heart ring pops. They look like this. See the heart? It's really cute. Turn next to me. We got these chocolate hearts. This little bag. Put a silver and red. We have these fudge hearts. Put two of those. And for our last one, we are going to put these luscious lips. It's chocolate shaped as lips. And they're shaped as lips. They're so cute. Ah. I'm gonna put two of those. And we are done. Okay, so we're just going to kind of take it like this. And you're going to grab like any tape ribbon or anything. And I got this tape slash ribbon because I couldn't find any ribbon. So I took some tape ribbon. And I have three different kinds actually. So then you get them all. These ones are just some little heart details. This one has some huge lips. And we got this one that says Love Sweet, the little cupcake. The ones I'm going to use are the little heart detailed ones. So now we're just going to take our tape and put it around and make a bow. Okay, so here's our little baggie. Took me a while to make the bow, but I finally got it. So after we put on the bow, we're going to put it in our cup. Just going to kind of stuff it in there and kind of put the edges out. 
And now you're going to grab your own plushie. I decided to use the monkey because it was red and it matched to the cup. So you're just going to put him down here. And if you want, you can even tape him to the thing um, and just give it to the person you want. Like I told you, it can be for anybody, a friend or anybody you want to give it to. So this is DIY number one. Okay, so I'm going to put my first DIY to the side. On to my second DIY. Okay, so clear my section. So we're going to start with a big base. You can use like a big cup or a vase. I got this one for $1 at the dollar store. So you're going to need a vase, some flowers, and some pencils. So I got my pencils first, and I'm going to open them. That is the first thing we are going to um, put in. So I grabbed some Valentine um, pencils, so I'm gonna put like two of each but the most I can. I actually decided to put them all. I'm gonna kind of mix them so they won't be like in the same group. And just put them in there, mix them. Like that. And I would decide this for a teacher because I think teachers love pencils a lot. So I would give this to a teacher, but you can give it to whoever you want. And we also need some sharpeners. I didn't mention, um, so I'm going to open mine. So I'm just going to grab all of them and just put them in there. And I also buy erasers to put in there, but you don't need um, erasers. You can just put sharpeners or just erasers. Here are my erasers, and they are a pack of 12 with cute heart shapes and owls and little circles that says, Be Mine. Really cute. So let's open it. And I'm pretty sure teachers love erasers also. So. Just saying. Or you can give it to your sister if she loves to draw and she loves erasers. So I'm just gonna put all of them in there. So I'm gonna put my hand, like kinda mix it. So all the sharpeners. This is how it should look like so far. Now let's put in our roses. And these are actually fake roses, but they are very beautiful. So I'm going to place it in there. And I actually got some baby flower, also fake, which I'm also gonna put in there. One more. Okay, so now I'm going to use some more tape to put around the vase. I'm going to use my cupcake one that says sweet love. So I'm just gonna put it around the vase. This is how my bow looks like. I think it's very pretty. And my mom made it because I got really confusing for me, so she did it. She did a wonderful job. I think this is perfect for the teachers or anyone who you desire, so I think this was really pretty. And you can also give it to your mom because I bet she will love roses and this. Really cute. Also give it to yourself because when you're doing your homework you can just grab a sharpener and sharpen your new pencil you can grab an eraser so yeah there's my second DIY I'm gonna put that to the side now into my third DIY this one's really simple all you're going to need is a box and like a stuffed animal you want today I'll be using my teddy bear and it's chocolate scented yum so we're going to start by putting him in there, kind of putting him to the side so we can squish a bit more things in there. Okay, and we're going to be using these ones. They are heart picks. Kind of says instead of toothpicks, heart picks. So we are going to cut them open. You can put as many as you like. I'm going to be putting two. I think it looks really cute. 
so far. Then, just for fun, I'm going to put some stickers. These are some cute little boxes with stickers inside. They're like Valentine's. So let's open them. So I'm just gonna put like a bunch. Like that, and looks really cute. So I'm going to put some big kisses in there for a cute little teddy bear. I'm gonna throw a red and also pink. And voila, it looks so cute and it's so simple. All you need is a box of stickers and some chocolate teddy bear, a little box and two heart picks and voila, you can make something really cute and simple. Okay, and put that to the side. And on to my fourth DIY. You can grab any color. I use pink also at the dollar store for $1. And they're pink. Really cute. So you're going to start by putting anything you want. I'm going to start by putting in some roses in each. And I'm going to cut off the stickers. because I don't think that looks too fancy. Or sweet or romantic. So I'm just going to cut it off. And now you're going to add any treat, like I got this marshmallow hearts, which I'm going to pop in there. And then for this one, I'm going to pop in my marshmallow rose. It's really cute also. And there we go, it looks really cute and it's really simple. You need a vase, some flowers, and two little marshmallow things that have sticks. And voila! There you go! Very easy. You can give this to your mom or dad. And for my fifth DIY. Okay, so now I'm going to make these two boxes. It came with two. So I'm going to cut off the little thing. So to make the plushies stand out, I'm going to use some sticker boxes. And just because it will make it stand out, it can also have some stickers so lots of people have some stickers also. Okay, so now we're going to put little mounds of candy in each. And we also got some hard gummies, which are really cute, so we're also going to put in there. So did me open one to show it to you. So this is how it looks like. It's white in the back, and it's red in the front. Really cute. So since we opened it, let's try it. Mmm, really chewy. Mmm, and we also got these other heart caramel chocolate. Okay, so now let's put in the two plushies. So I'm using my pink teddy bear, and I'm going to use my green frog. I'm going to bend the two parts. And it looks totes cute. And I'm going to add some more of those little heart picks. Just like that. Okay, so for my first one, I'm going to add a little heart. And in the heart, we have some little sweet tarts shaped as hearts. In the case, it's also a heart. And it's red, so we're going to put it in there. So we also got some slinkies, so I'm going to put some in there. So I'm going to put one in each. One's going to be red, one's going to be half pink. And I also got another heart that is purple, like the red one, which we're going to put with the frog. And you got some two cute gift boxes. Okay, so here are my five completed DIYs. And here are cute vases for our first part with a little rose marshmallow rose and our little heart. For our second part, we got our little box with the teddy bear and our stickers and chocolates with some lollipops. I added that. <laughs> and for our first year, why? We got the little cup with the little candy with the monkey it's hugging it. Then we got our huge vase with the erasers, sharpeners, and pencils, and our roses on top. 
And for our last DIY, we got our little boxes with our frog with a kiss right here and a pink teddy bear. Well guys, that's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share. And I just wanted to say a huge announcement. Thank you because I just reached 200,000 subscribers and I'm like so excited. And just thank you so much because I wouldn't have done it without you guys. And it's only been a year and a half and I already have that many subscribers, 200,000. It's like a lot and it's a big number. So thank you so much to all my subscribers and, and I hope you have a happy Valentine's Day. Love you!